My name is Carolyn Travisano, and I'm here to tell you about painting on feathers. Uh, so we'll begin our demonstration with how I choose the feathers uh, to paint my designs on. And I used uh, basically four different types of feathers. Uh, they're turkey, peacock, pheasant, and sometimes quail. Uh, depending on what type of design or portrait or scene that I'm doing. So I'm just going to pull a few out here for you and I'll tell you what they are and why they make the better choice as far as feathers are concerned. Uh, I like using the turkey feather and this one's a good example because it gives me a nice wide area to paint on. So I can either do a nice scene across the length of it or going across, across the top we can do a nice portrait or an animal. And also because they're a little bit thicker than most feathers as well so they hold the paint a lot nicer. And this is another turkey feather. Uh, I believe it's the, the inner wing. And also, again, I like using this one because it's a thicker feather and wider. So it has enough space for a portrait or an animal design. And this is an interior peacock feather. And we've got a couple of different ones. I love using these because I can do really great long designs across the entire feather and they're nice and thick as well so they hold the paint nicely. And this is a pheasant feather. Again, great design on the background of the feather and also nice and thick and wide for pretty much any design. Uh, I like to go ahead at the beginning stage and just do a little design going down the center of the feather on the quill part. And you, for that I use a paint marker. Uh, because it has a waxy film on it, it doesn't really hold the paint that well and it can over time actually chip off. So um, using the paint marker, this has a like an enamel base so it, it really adheres to the quill part of the feather.